Magamagab, everybody. It is a video I thought of. I said, I, I should make a video about songs that I like that suck. I realize they suck, but I can't help liking them. And now, there are songs I like that many of you think suck, but I don't think they suck, so they don't really make the list. Like, I'll give you an example. Um, I've seen a lot of hate for Memory Remains from Metallica. Um, I like it. I don't think it sucks. So that's why I didn't make my list. And, you know, uh, just like everybody out there that likes 1979 from Smashing Pumpkins, that to me is the worst song ever written. Period. And in my opinion, you like a song that sucks. But in your opinion, you should realize it sucks as well. And still like it, because that's what I'm about to do. I got eight songs that I'm going to talk about, and I'm sure there'll be a part two and part three, because every time I hear a song that I think sucks, I'm going to jot it down and make another video about songs that suck. So here we go at number eight, Iron Maiden's Quest for Fire. I mean, I've always disliked this song. But in recent years, well, I'd say maybe like eight years ago, uh, I'm driving around and this song comes on and I'm like, ugh. And then I'm listening to it. I was like, man, this song sucks, but it's awesome. Especially that middle lead section. That's some killer metal, cheeserific, sucking song. But I love it. So that I put a number eight. And I shouldn't even classify these as numbers, you know. I, but I will, I, I will admit, number one is a doozy. All right, uh, number seven. Calling On You from Striper. Um, I dig Striper, but this song is so sucky. It's all like bubblegummy and, you know, it's like a... It's it's definitely like a, a total bubblegum song to some, you know, guitar solos. But I like it, and I especially like it when they play it live. But boy, that song sucks. All right, next one. Oh, boy. Mantronic. From Wasp. Oh, yes. Mantronic. L listen to the, the title itself sucks. Mantronic. Man on the loose. Bionic. My neck in a noose. I love it. It sucks. I admit it sucks. But I love it. I love that sucky ass song. All right, next. Oh, boy. Yeah, there's a doozy as well. Kiss. Uh, all night. Oh, my God. This song sucks, but it doesn't suck so bad. It sucks so good. I totally dig it. It's total cheeserific. Everything I hated about Kiss in the 80s is in this song, but yet they make it work somehow in this one. So that's uh, number four. I mean, number five. Number four. Oh, man. Judas Priest with Love You to Death. I'll ram it down. Oh, my. This song. Hurt me, baby! Wow, what a sucky song that I love! Alright, number three. Uh, Motley Crue, Something for Nothing off of Girls, Girls, Girls. It has annoying female vocals that I can't stand. And it's just a uh, not very well structured song. But I love it, regardless. I love that sucky ass song, Something for Nothing. And number two, oh boy, this one. This one sucks, but it sucks good. Queen with Don't Stop Me Now. Oh my. This song is like I'm enjoying it, and then now and then I get a little cringe. But I go back to enjoying it. It's a weird one. All right, number one. This this is the here. This is the, the doozy of them all. Uh, I think if I ever make a sequel to this, it still won't find a song as sucky as this, and I like it. And boy, I do not like this band. Linkin Park with Breaking My Habit. Now, this song has all the elements I don't like about Linkin Park. The little, you know, uh, turntables scratching and the little, you know, little sound effects. It has all that is in this song. But yet I love it. I love this the way this guy sings. I love his voice. And I just think everything connects in this song. But at the same time, I hear all the things that suck about this band and this song. 
uh, I just think it works here. So there you have it. There's the eight songs that uh, I know suck, but I still love it. Can you admit to yourself liking songs that suck? Am I the only person out there? If you love songs that suck, put it in the description below. Uh, you know, I mean, you have to have no shame like me. You know, because there's a lot of people that would, wouldn't want to discuss stuff like that. You know, people that like, we built this city on rock and roll and stuff like that. But anyway, I don't like that one. But uh, I've heard worse, though. Anyway, thank you all for watching. If you like donating, I got a PayPal in the description below. Please subscribe to my channel if you have not. So, stay frosty. Listen to Black Sabbath. And smack them a gob. Before we get canceled, check out the Rock and Metal Combat Podcast with me and Wadzilla. We are the Podcast Kings. Link to the podcast is in the description below and also a link to the YouTube page. Check out all their episodes with visuals. And very soon, either Ian and I will learn how to go on YouTube live. Might be soon. So check out the greatest podcast ever according to science.com. It's also God's favorite podcast and Satan's favorite podcast as well. So check out the Rock and Metal Combat Podcast before we get canceled.